Well, it's really heating up out there, but you are all in for a frozen treat this afternoon. Matt is in the kitchen with Tyler Groff from DaVinci Science Center, who's going to show us how to make instant ice cream. Guys? We had ice cream on our minds this morning, remember? <laughs> yes. And we're making it. And look who I recruited. <laughs> Jen. <Yeah>. Hi, Jen. <laughs> hey, Tyler, how are you? Good, how are you? I'm good. Excellent. All right, so let's get right to it. I'm gonna I'm gonna pour the ingredients and then back away. Yes. And Miss Jen over here is going to stir. And meanwhile, while you're doing that, I'm actually gonna pour out some liquid nitrogen, which yeah, is our special secret ingredient. Yeah. Uh, negative 320 degrees Fahrenheit. Mm. Um, liquid nitrogen is incredibly cold, um, but otherwise is actually found in our air, so we can totally eat it once it's all gone. We never want to put liquid nitrogen in our bodies while it's a liquid, um, but once it returns to the air and all boils away, we can totally Totally eat the ice cream left afterward. That is so. such cool fog. <laughs> um, so yes, fog it is, it, it's boiling away right here. You can start to pour your ingredients okay. into your bowl. Um, so we'll start out with some sugar. Sugar. That one, I believe, is your guys' special ingredient. Is it coconut cream? Coconut cream, yep, absolutely. So WFMZ's participated in Ice Cream Wars 10 this past Saturday, um, where they actually made their very own, uh, uh, what was it, a coconut delight flavor, um, which actually won them um, the most unique recipe via our foodie panel. You which won is, again? You won, yeah. Wow. <laughs> so this is milk cream? That one's milk and heavy cream, so okay. you want to pour that in there. Uh, essentially, the more milk fat, the better when we start actually looking at um, uh, combining it to make some excellent ice cream. Okay. Um, and of course, vanilla. a teaspoon of vanilla, just to make sure you have that extra flavor in there. Is that it? Am I done? <laughs> I believe so. Yeah. Oh yeah, I gotta whisk. So we'll have you whisk, um, just to get the sugar kind of dissolved in all of those creamy substances. It's um, a nice whisk. <laughs> Thank you. <laughs> Did you see yours? Uh, yeah, we actually bring a lot of these materials out. Um, we'll do this in schools. We do it as part of our outreach birthday parties. So mm -hmm. um, if you missed Ice Cream Wars, we can actually bring a part, a part of Ice Cream Wars to you um, with our ice cream, or with our uh, Super Coolness birthday party package. Oh, so okay. we can make this for all of your, your kids' friends. Uh, if you had a whole bunch of them in the garage uh, for a fun little uh, alternative or twist on a birthday party. Is that good? That's good. That's perfect. So now we'll switch out. We'll let Jen uh, do some of the stirring while I pour in liquid nitrogen because she's got the safety material on. So like I said, we can just pour this off to the side and as Jen continues to stir, um, it'll actually flash freeze all of the ingredients very, very quickly. Um, so we can have ice cream in a matter of minutes here. Uh, now, this is not the final product, right? You guys have some toppings to throw on there? Yeah. <laughs> <Of course. laughs> so I believe that we have um, some shortbread, uh, chocolate sh striped shortbread cookies actually over there, and some coconut uh, to go on top, some toasted coconut. You know, the cool thing about this, Tyler, is yeah. that it's like a mystery because you can't see what you're doing. <laughs> you really can't. Absolutely. Right? You can't see, right, Jen? I, I can clump here, but I'm not really sure. It's kind of cool that way. That is difficult. Um, it starts to clump up in different areas based on where the nitrogen is, and that's why uh, stirring is a very important part of this process. Right. Um, um, on Saturday, we actually asked you guys to make 22 gallons of ice cream. Um, so that's essentially, if this makes about a half a gallon, um, you guys had to make 44 separate batches um, of this ice cream on Saturday. Um, it's like an all-day event. It is. It is totally an all-day event. Um, <laughs> Which is cool. They are making ice cream essentially from 9.30 in the morning until 3.30 p.m. Wow. Um, in order to make sure that all of our visitors get a chance to try their, uh, their frozen concoctions. Um, yeah, so oh, if you comes. happen to miss Ice Cream Wars this year, uh, yeah. never fear, it is an annual event. Uh, right. So this is our 10th anniversary. We'll make sure that we do it um, year over year uh, because there's always something new going on at DaVinci Science Center. And this is by far one of our signature events um, that really pulls people out, um, gets us something to do uh, with the kids and with the entire family. Um, who doesn't love ice cream? Right. So. And it's always in early January, right? Uh, yes. Like for the, the past 10 years. weekend or something like that. Absolutely. It has been for the, uh, for the past 10 years. We've kept it in early January because it's something fun to do. We want to make sure that... Um, well, we kind of have a little bit of cabin fever, especially this time of year yeah, with the yeah. cold weather. Right. Um, you might give you something to do at the center. So. All right, we got to wrap it, Tyler. We're out of time. Awesome job. What do you want to do last? Uh, no problem. We're actually just going to serve our ice cream there. So Jen's able to take a big heaping. Nice. That's about a single wow. serving. So. <laughs> and then top it with what you want. Yep, absolutely. Awesome so they'll be, have, job. be able to top it off with your, your final ingredients there. Perfect. Tyler, thank you so yeah. much. Always Happy New pleasure. Year. Yeah, thank you. you. Jen, well done. <laughs> on camera. Have a great weekend. <laughs> Alexandra, we're going to eat. Yes, it All looks right. delicious. Yes. We're definitely jealous. Thank you, Jen, Matt, and Tyler from Enjoy the Dimension Science guys. Center. Thanks for joining us. That'll do it for 69 News at Noon. Thank you for watching. Have a great day. Bye, everyone.